Welcome back. This is Everyone Loves Pirates, and we're continuing on with Crashlands, a very cool action RPG that's very story heavily. Uh, what's the even word for that? Story driven, heavily story driven. Uh, I love the writing. That's what drew me to this game. But I also love that the systems, uh, while complex, don't require a whole lot of uh, crazy grinding and inventory management and all that kind of stuff. Uh, so what are we going to do? We are going to check out the new stuff because we just have a new thing here. Oh, we can make basic glue. It's sticky like glue should be. True. Well, we definitely want some armor and stuff. Definitely better armor. Uh, but we... Uh, ooh, actually, our weapon's not that bad. Ooh, a bomb. We need more hide for that. So we can track only one thing at a time from a station. Yeah, I bet we try. Let's try making a sawboard. It's most of the stuff we need anyways. Um, can we track things from two stations, though? Oh, what do I want to build? We'll need a, vest, a nest eventually. What is this? Okay, those are the blue dudes. That's nah, not going to happen. We can make ourselves a crown. Give us a little bit of more protection. Wood gloves. Nah, I don't want to really waste resources on this stuff. Uh, but just out of curiosity, can we track that as well as the other thing? Nope. Good to know. I've never played this game before this series, though I watched someone else play it a little bit. Okay, which way do we want to go? So, this is not me showing you how to play the game. This is me learning how to play the game along with you. Actually, I've actually read very little of the, about it. The story is so much up my my wheelhouse that I didn't want to spoil anything at all. Okay, so do we need more of these? I do not think so. But we need more sawgrass. We need more just regular wood. And I do know that we're going to need tons of little wampus parts and stuff. Ooh, more healing things. Man, I thought I stunned him in time. Well, that's not... Something new! A leather bag chair. Or when you want to sit in something and feel like you can never get out of it. The leather version is even better because it sticks to your thighs. Not a fan of leather. Like, it could be, like, a leather jacket is fine, but sitting on leather, on leather seats, car seats, one, you slide around on them, so they're bad for, like, a sports car. Oh, not in time. Tried. Oh, I accidentally, ah, dang it, hit my duck. My duck pie was too close. We do everything, we have everything we need to make the next weapon, though. Actually, that was stupid. I should have, uh, I should have looked at... There's got to be a way to do this. I guess not. Um, I really should have looked at the armor that I actually do need. There we go. I just got to be closer, quicker on the button and pay attention to how quickly he's swinging. Haha, uh, lightning and blood. I don't think we're actually going to beat this, which is another reason why I don't want to make the next weapon. I'd rather skip another level up if I can, but I don't know how often weapons are available. I was really hoping to find another teleporter. Be a little better with the button pushing. I really should find some more of the heifers. They're going to give us more and uniquer stuff as well and i would love to get a companion as soon as possible really all they are is just a a free attack they can't get hurt or anything oops so normally i don't care for companions in games but this one's silent and just attacks for you that's it or you can leave them at home to get you supplies for things milk them or whatever and earlier, it rained and poured when it came to heifers.
wonder how good this magnetism is on items. If I break it, will it follow me no matter where I am kind of thing? That would be nice. I'm going off after stuff I know I'll eventually need. But uh, I probably should be focusing on the wampets. I remember there was a heifer over here, assuming she's still there. Probably bacon flour ain't a bad idea. You do eventually get stuff that allows you to harvest quicker as well. I was kind of hoping to that would happen quickly. <laughs> but every game is going to be different, even though the story is going to be the same. Hmm. No wampet moms yet. Oh, yeah, no, it did follow me. Good. Okay, there's one. We'll kill the babies first, I guess. Like I said, every guy attacks differently, too. Every type of enemy will attack differently. And the bigger ones will have different attacks as well, or different speeds and stuff. So it keeps the combat interesting. Come on. There we go. That's all I want. Well, let's get some of these nice, pretty kind of things. Bleed them. Oh, oh, that was really close. Come on, kill him, kill him. Nice. Oh, we got a heart. Intact wampet heart. We got some sinew. Yeah, we definitely need some armor. Um... I don't know how much stuff I got, though. Uh, R. Nope, not R. That's this stuff. I want build, probably. Is W. Not build. How do I... see how much Wampet stuff I have? What's this? A cup? A ball? Like... I don't know. Well, I guess you click on these, they show up down here, and then you put them on the slot. Okay. It'd be nice if there had been a tooltip or something on that. Hmm. Oh, there's another heifer, right? Yeah, let's do that. There we go, there's some lightning. Yeah, I knew a double one was coming soon. Still no eggs, actually nothing good from that guy. Oh, a couple hefts. Oh, I missed. Which sucks because I wanted to use that for the big guys. Okay, let's get this heifer while she's by herself. What the heck? That was weird. I wonder if you can use the environment to kind of help keep you safe. I'm not really sure how close I can get to this guy, like how accurate that circle is. And since he can kill me in one jump, yes, we got an egg. Lucky on the second episode too, I think. I could make an enormous breakfast burrito. Or, you know, just maybe you could hatch it. Imagine your own wampet to follow you around and stomp your enemies into splatters. I can imagine that. Sounds gross and awesome, like most things. But you can make an incubator if you, yeah. Mother duck. So we got a little quest line here, which I love. Let's uh, click on this so we know we can make it. Cool. Well, let's go back and do that right now. I really, really, really wanted to find some place I could teleport to out here because we made some pretty decent distance, I feel like. Yeah, let's let's work our way back around this lake thing. Anything interesting in the middle of that lake thing? Nope. Uh, these blue guys would kick our butt, but I can show you their attack if you want. 
So they're quite quick and they kind of just charge you. But once again, it shows you what direction they're going to charge. And they got a lightning attack and stuff like that. I mean, we could kill one, but I'd rather have our Wampet pet help us kill one. Ooh. Okay, well, we learned that that's a dead end. And I'll remember that it has lots of wood and sticks and stuff. I should have picked up the sticks. Yeah. One, two, buckle my shoe. Three, four, something about a door. I don't even remember anymore. Five, six, pick up sticks. There we go. Turbo speed. Oh, can I? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Can I leave a note anywhere? That's a waypoint. Oh, no. You know, that's a shame. Clearly, this is just a little indie company that made this game. I think it's three brothers. But, um, man, I love it if I can make notes about where things were. Because you guys know from watching my Dwarf Fortress videos, my memory is atrocious. I literally cannot remember the name of something that I just looked up two seconds ago. Ooh, another heifer. You know what? Now that we have the speed, we should probably be using it to attack. I got two of them on me, though. Oh, gosh. I probably should have stunned him. Oh, get the little guy. No. <laughs> this is actually pretty fun. <laughs> I'll admit I would prefer just in my brain a different control scheme, but who knows? Okay, I have a feeling that we, uh, yeah. Oh, we got one. We didn't actually see it, but um, apparently we got close enough where it showed up on the map. Man, that seems like nowhere even close. I wonder if we found it. No, we didn't find it earlier, I don't think. There you go. So we can actually just warp right in here. There's a really big blue dude. Let's uh, see if we can snag this Swamper out of here. All right, some good lightning. Thought that was going to be a double. Really? No doubles yet? Oh, there it is. Oh, shoot. Okay. And now you'll see that this game does not have permadeath. That was nice that it was right next to the other thing. You do lose some of your items and stuff. Um, while we're here... Oh, apparently we need to also heal up a bit. Um, I don't really want to use my duck for that, but I might have to. Okay, well, let's get our, our hatch or thing going. I don't know if you can have more of the same guy or not. I don't think you can. All right. Wampet Incubator. What else can we do? Well, we can build a vest, which would be quite nice. Um, I don't know if we'll have enough material to do another thing, but I think the vest is going to help us the most. It looks like we can get that as well. I think we can queue this up. Yeah, let's get some pants. Yeah. There you go. It tells you even how long it would take. So if we wanted to, we could get out of here. We can go to build, I think it was, infinity, egg time, and I'll just put it there, and uh, back. Pet time! Just when you're sure you... Oh, sorry. <laughs> just make sure you name it right when it comes out. Just make sure you name it right when it comes out. Eh, either way. So it imprints on you. Okay, can do. Let's check this out. It's telling us that we have stuff available. I don't think we'll get two awesome things in a row. So let's look at these first. Yep, regular quality. Wampets of thorns. Wamp pants of thorns. We'll put those on. Give us something good. All right. Green. Poison resist. And a little bit of shock chance, too. Now, this is actually really cool the way they do this. I love that it shows you... You don't even have to compare them back and forth in your mind. Uh, it just tells you immediately what's better and what you're losing. Very well done. Like it. Uh, we can make some glue if we make glue. Oh, we can make bombs. I, we don't even need glue to make bombs, do we? I wonder what the glue's for. Well, let's definitely build some bombs. I'm tempted to make even more. It does give us three. This is different stuff, so let's make a little bit of glue just so we have some around. Maybe they'll tell us what we do with it. Um, let's make some more bombs. Okay, and then this... Tells us in four minutes it'll be ready. And, well, something is ready? Oh, 
forgot to pick up the rest of my bombs. That's good. I like that that icon's up there. It's pretty obvious. Okay, I'm gonna waste some uh, some space turducken, and then we will wait till we are completely healed. Oh, close. And we'll just warp in. See if the game's nice and nope, it's not. <laughs> Yay, we got some of our stuff back. Okay. Um, it changed stuff around. I don't really like that so much. So how can I change that? Can't drag it, but we can unequip it and then put it here. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, that's somewhat tedious. Uh, keep peeling things over here because they'll always be there and then other stuff there and that's F so that's good that's away from my home row kind of thing where my fingers are very good uh, speaking of map did we have it uh, WSAD apparently can't move around at all with the mouse interesting can't use the mouse wheel though uh, it doesn't look like we have anywhere in particular that we're any oh that was right the resonance thing we probably should head over there uh, I'm going to go around this lake first, though, while we wait, and then we'll get our pet and head out over there. Yeah, we're going to have a hard time, I think, beating this uh, weapon for a little bit. Of course, you can make as many weapons as you want of other stuff, so basically you can re-roll their attributes over and over again. And you can get some of your materials back as well. Be good, be good, be good! It's a pillow! glow pillow for those times where you want to not fall asleep but you want to rest your head another heifer you know we got what we needed from the heifer which was an egg um, oh we forgot to choose a new thing to build um, actually if I go to quests now it doesn't show me the things that just popped up so if I can grab it right away and click on it it will It'll set it over here, but if I don't, I'm out of luck. Ooh, a bull. Considering a heifer can kill us one shot, I'm going to stay away from a bull. For now. We're going to get a little better... Uh, I guess I should be killing some of these guys. Get a little better kitted out first. That's right, baby. I guess we could have used a bomb. Oh, that was a good one. Let's try it. Oh, apparently I can't click. Hmm. Probably be good for multiple enemies. Got some more toenails. There we go. There's something that'll make me feel better. Some bacon flour. There we go. Getting lots of skin, you heifer. That's good. Yeah, keep bleeding. I love bleeding. Not myself. I think I like it so much because it makes sense. There's a lot of stuff that doesn't make sense in games. But when things do make sense, we got some... Sun Shroom. Don't know what it's good for, but uh, eventually we'll get some use out of it, I'm sure. Okay. And if we come back home after going around this lake, I bet our little buddy will be all grown up. I'm going to stay away from him. He doesn't seem to care about hurting me any. Oh, Time Warp. I have no idea what that means. What does Time Warp do? It won't... No mouse overs? Oh, everyone else is slower. That's cool. I wish it was longer, though. We could have knocked out one of those blue guys. Oh, there's a glutterfly attack, or whatever it was called. Quite a pain. Oh. fast enough sorry for the screaming oh also not fast enough crud at least equipment doesn't get hurt i don't think that was a pretty long reach there 
Lots of sinew and bone. There's our fishing bait and our power of flight. And if we look at the map, so I can remember where that good lake was. Okay, so right there is where we want to fish. And we'll just teleport back. Could have picked up stuff on the way, but I bet our egg is ready now. I can fly. Oh. <laughs> did it happen to just jump out immediately or when I clicked on it? Was that coincidence? Okay. Womp it. We'll name him. Oh, man. Uh, this would be a great thing for a uh, subscriber or something. And I have no idea who is even interested in these videos or watching. Uh, let's... I should have thought of this ahead of time. Uh, I bet I can change it later. We'll just call him Bessie. Or her Bessie. It's what cows are all named. Okay, and now we got this little dude that'll follow us around. We can click on here and tell him to go back to the nest. And we can tell him to come out. We can upgrade him. That's what that is, but we don't know how to do that yet. And we can talk. Or not talk. We can ask it for things. Like milk. Yeah, let's make some milk. Don't know what the milk's for, but... Well, you can milk just about anything. Milk anything with nipples, right? That's what they say. Okay, let's go check out our little thing down here. Let's pick up some stuff. I guess I'd be taking advantage of flying over water if I can. Okay, we're going to go way to the right. There'll be plenty of things to kill over there. But some things that don't take time to pick up, I definitely want to pick up. I feel like I move faster when I'm flying. Ooh, he's, uh, no, that's what I have her. Just things are changing. All right, we found a place we can warp to. A lot of guys that want to kill us and could very easily do so. Go around blue there. You got somebody who's named up there or something. What was that? Uh, regenerating health. Well, that helps us out actually quite a bit. How long is that good for? I missed it. Ah, I wish there was a place where I could see what they just told me. Maybe there is. Was it under data, maybe? Nope. Okay, should have paid attention. So maybe we can kill this guy. Since we're recovering health. Um, I kind of feel like I died and then it let me live because of the recovering health. I might have to help it along because I don't want to run out of it. Oh, we forgot to take our guy. I <laughs> left him there making milk. It's kind of the whole freaking point, wasn't it? I don't like how the health bar can get hidden. It's unfortunate. Oh, keep going. Thank goodness. Blue's not attacking, which is great. Come on, get him, get him, get him, get him. Nice. Okay, let's um, quickly go back, <laughs> grab our Wampit. Luckily, we found a place we could teleport to down here. Come here, thank you very much. And then let's... Um, oh, we need to pick something that we want to make, don't we? Glow juice. Okay, we got to get it from those glow bugs, probably. Don't really need a leather bag chair. I don't really see what the point of that is right now. Uh, we definitely want to make some okay so we need sawgrass leaf and wampet bone we actually have enough wampet bone so we just need uh, more wampet parts and sawgrass you know what i want to track the sawgrass part i guess and let's jump back over there bet you could even milk it way ahead of you it is just a baby that is kind of weird you know i wasn't totally joking what? Why would I do that? Well, we gotta take advantage of every possible resource. I agree. Try putting that milk-tastic beast of yours back in its nest and feed it some sawgrass leaves. 
Less feelings, more milking. That wasn't so hard, was it? I guess not, but what can I do with it? No idea. Hopefully useful and tasty. Thanks, my Wumple. Uh, I'm not going to say any of that. Okay. I would have, but I was frustrated that we left him behind. Want to level him up. Okay. Do do do. What are you doing to me? Sawgrass is what I need. One of the few golf tournaments I watch, or try to watch, besides the Masters, is uh, TPC at Sawgrass. Reminds me of my childhood. Oh, all right, new schematic. A glowy bag chair. I bet I know what you need to make that. Okay, well, since you aggroed. I collect a bunch of sawgrass seeds. Think there's a way to grow them? Definitely. Yep, we found those dirt things. We can fertilize them and drop the seeds in. How do I make fertilized dirt? You're not going to like this. <laughs> That's what he says. You're not going to like this. It's kind of uh, dirty. Ho, 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 ho. Good one, juice box. But seriously, though, super dirty. Kind of a crappy job, but someone's got to do it. Fertile dirt. You know what? I'm going to track that. And we have enough to do already. That was lucky. I decided to run away, but I'm still attacking. Okay, I definitely want to find this area over here first. Oh, maybe that's it. Something. It's a rotted ruin. Ooh. A chest. Oh. I actually thought I was going to have to, like, make something. Like a key or a pick. Find that resource. You know, right-clicking doesn't seem to do anything. It's a shame. We need a pickaxe to break that. I think that's a bowl. They seem not to aggravate me when I'm flying. Ooh, what are you? Turbo fishing bait power. Well, where's the lake? Why would you put those somewhere where there's not a lake? It's a dry lake. Do, 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 do. Flying around you. Okay, wrong button. Oh, we gotta go south. Okay, good. Get some sawgrass. Get some sticks. Stick. Stick. My assumption, uh, I probably did see this quest that I'm going on, or will be going on. I kind of want to just hover over the water and see what happens when this runs out. There we go. I can't remember if I have to kill any wampets or any... Dang, that guy's close. For any of these kind of quests that it's going to give me. That aggroed him, huh? Oh, yeah, we don't want to do this. This is stupid. Here, follow me out here. Hey, you. Come out to the lake. <laughs> he's so fast I can't even get a swing off okay good now he's out of the way can you feel the power mm -hmm. nope the crystal calls to me it is so shiny for who go do co anything yes yes three batteries and the crack -a -laka -laka. who go do co juice box she's talking about that jerky floaty head dude Hey, that's a reservoir I picked up on my scan. We need to get it out of here. I have a suspicion that it's Hugo's. I don't think he's going to approve. Flux is the only way we're going to build a comm station. We gotta try something. Hey, purpley, let's talk outside. Oh, are you Sean Connery? I, I can't do that for everything he says. Thanks for meeting me. Derndz. Not right in the head. I worry that Crystal does more than just talk to her. We'd be happy to take it off your hands. And I'd be indebted for you to do this, so, sir. But I need to know you ain't evil before I swear myself to help. Want to pinky swear? I mean, how do I know you aren't evil? Or you ain't even evil? So I made him Scottish and Irish, and now he's a hick. Maybe you and that there box there, Hudo go, gotta get, be in skies there, huh? Ha, nope. Hudoku. Hudoku. With the numbers in the square. Blew up our ship. Do we look like villains to you? Eh, maybe you don't look like it. But that box of yours sure is dastardly looking. I, I think he wants to be Scottish. Good old juice box. I made him myself. I didn't even put a single dastardly component. Well then, I suppose you ain't evil. You prove it by doing me a favor. A favor for the crystal? Sounds fair. Well, my home, my old home. 
That's got to be really annoying, me just jumping between various accents. A good distance southwest of here has been overrun by some nasty wompets. You find it clear out for dern to me, and I consider you that boxes, folks. What do you trust? Mm -hmm. Deal. Okay. So we got to find something. <laughs> His old home, southwest of here, has been overrun. And we got to kill those wompets. So good, we do have to kill wompets. Um, it looks like there's some extra quests as well. I have no idea what this thing is. But I, apparently I can slap it. What are you doing out here? Exiled myself to the outdoors? I did. Maybe it is. Done a cowardly thing and blessed Mara's roots. I'm feeling the shame of it. See, my Irish and my Scottish is basically the same. Unless it's Sean Connery. Couldn't that be bad? Flux, here you got all the way across the universe before realizing she forgot the shipment. Hey, you promised to keep... Oh, oops, that's Flux. If you ain't shown her shames with me, I suppose it's all right to say. See that shapely tinderum on the other side of the paddle pool? Yeah, I'm not sure shapely is quite the word I'd use. So you kick Fleep and I were out having ourselves a picnic when these three big wampets came a tearing into our meal. I got it up and ran, even I didn't grab for me kick flip or nothing, I saved me own skin only. Well, at least you didn't push him down so you could escape while they chewed on your screaming body. I think the only thing that put me back in Kyle Fleep's graces would be to have them three beasts there taken out. I can do that for you. I'm getting pretty good at handling the wampets. I can use the extra whatever he's going to give us. Well, that's mighty kind of you. They roam somewhere out there. The first one you want to take down is Grump. Come back to me when it's done. Can do. We see Grump, he dies. Oh, we're still fine. Oh, it's going to be hard to shake that. Oh, dang, I didn't mean to womp him on the head. Maybe that's how you talk in this game. Floury stranger, I don't you suppose you could help a right fellow out? I don't mean to be in no trouble, but I just I, I lost my entertainment ring, and I need it back something terrible. Mm. Now I'm like Paul from the Beatles. Entanglement ring? When the Tindram commit to one another, they ask the martial root for a ring. It's symbolic about the joining of two lives to the root of Marsaya. See that Tindram? I uh, it's something over there on there. Well, we're launching, launching, and ain't got jumped by then three enraged wampets. It's actually harder to read it normally now. I'll lead around faster than lightning. Should have seen him. I took more of a tumble, but when I came to, the ring was gone. Oddly wouldn't right trust me again till I get that ring back. I'll keep an eye out for it. Where'd you lose it? Not sure, but I ran through a patch of whistle root. Might be snagged on there and came off. Okay, so uh, somewhere around, there's going to be a ring. Uh, that would probably be that one because it says ring. So we have no idea where it is, it looks like. Um, but he ran through some whistle root, so we might find it near whistle root. And of course, anything we find that we can pick up, we will. Uh, but first off, uh, we want to do the thing with the stuff. I don't know how to do the thing with the stuff. Okay, my old home, a good distance southwest. Southwest. All right, we can do that. I kind of thought it'd be on the map. Oh, there it is. <laughs> because I'm a blind idiot. Well, we're at 30 plus minutes already on this episode, but I am having a lot of fun as I knew I would. And I really haven't seen a whole lot that's new yet. So as things get even more progressive, we can't do anything with these. Um, I think there's a, a real good chance that I'm going to be quite enthralled. Okay, well, I'm going to end this video here once again. It's pretty early on in the series, and I'm recording a few first few episodes just all together. So if you don't mind, please just slap on a like or a dislike, depending on whether you'd like to see more of these videos. Or even better, some comments would be great. Uh, you can tell me how much you hate my stupid accents and how I should never speak out loud again. Or you might say that you love them. You want different types of accents, which I'm probably not even able to do. Uh, whatever it happens to be, please uh, give me a little talk there, and I will listen. Thanks for watching, folks. I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.